a Wikividi Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. T-Pain Fahim Rashad Najm, better known by his stage name T-Pain, is an American singer, rapper, songwriter, and record producer. His debut album, Rapper Turned Sanger, was released in 2005. In 2007, T-Pain released his second album Epiphany, which reached number one on the US Billboard 200 chart. His third album, Three Rings, was released in 2008. T-Pain has also released a string of hit singles, including, I'm Sprung, I'm In Love, Buy You A Drank, Bartender, Can't Believe It, Five O'Clock, and more. T-Pain has earned two Grammy Awards, alongside artists Kanye West and Jamie Foxx respectively. T-Pain is the founder of the record label imprint Nappy Boy Entertainment, established in 2005. Throughout his career as a singer, T-Pain is best known for using and popularizing the creative use of the auto-tune pitch correction effect, used, with extreme parameter settings to create distinctive vocal sounds. From 2006 to 2010, T-Pain was featured on more than 50 chart-topping singles. His most successful feature to date was on Flo Rida's debut single, Low, which has since been certified 6X Platinum by the Recording Industry Association of America. Early Life Najm was born and raised in Tallahassee, Florida. His stage name is short for Tallahassee Pain, and was chosen because of the hardships he experienced while living there. Najm was brought up in a Muslim household, but he has expressed his lack of interest in the concept of religion. At just three years old he got his first taste of the music business when a friend of the family, gospel jazz artist slash producer Ben Tankard, allowed him to spend time and twist the knobs at his recording studio. At age 10, Najm turned his bedroom into a music studio, using a keyboard, a beat machine and a four-track recorder. 2004-2006, Early Career and Rapper Turned Sanger T-Pain joined the rap group Nappy Heads in 2004 and later recorded, I'm Fucked Up, a cover version of Akon's single, Locked Up. Recording artist Akon heard the song and immediately signed T-Pain to Convict Music, his label. After being discovered, T-Pain began singing instead of rapping. T-Pain subsequently recorded and released his debut album, Rapper Turned Sanger. On December 6, 2005, the album reached number 33 on the Billboard 200, and has since been certified gold by the RIAA, for reaching sales of 500,000 units. The album was preceded by the lead single, I'm Sprung, which was released in August 2005 and reached number 8 on the Billboard Hot 100, and number 9 on the Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart. The second single, I'm In Love featuring Mike Jones, was released in December 2005, and reached number 5 on the Hot 100 and number 10 on the Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart. The third and final single from the album, Studio Love, was released in October 2006, but failed to chart. 2007-2008, Epiphany In mid-2006, T-Pain began work on his second album, now with a Zomba label group as well as Convict Music and Jive Records. The album, titled Epiphany, was released on June 5, 2007. The album sold 171,000 records in its first week, reaching number one on the Billboard 200. The record has since sold 819,000 records in the United States. The album was preceded by the lead single, Buy You A Drank, featuring Young Jock in February 2007. The single reached number one on both the Hot 100 and Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart, becoming his first single to top charts. The album's second single, Bartender, featuring Akon was released in June 2007 and reached number five on the Hot 100, and number nine on the Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart. The third and final single from the album, Church, was released in October 2007, but failed to chart in the United States. Speaking in May 2007 to noted UK R&B writer Pete Lewis, of the award-winning Blues and Soul about his reason for naming his second album Epiphany, T. Payne stated, One of the two dictionary meanings of Epiphany is a sudden moment of insight or revelation. And to me the title Epiphany signifies the moment I realized that, 
to make the best music I can, I needed to just go in the studio, and be myself, and not concentrate so hard on following other people's formulas. While promoting his second album, T-Pain made guest appearances on multiple songs by other artists. T-Pain was featured on, I'm a Flirt, by R. Kelly with T.I., Out of My System, by Bow Wow, Baby Don't Go, by Fabulous, I'm So Hood, by DJ Khaled with many other rappers, Shorty, by Plies, Kiss Kiss, by Chris Brown, Low, by Flo Rida, and, Good Life, by Kanye West. In two weeks in late 2007, T-Pain was featured on four top 10 singles on the Billboard Hot 100 chart, Good Life, with Kanye West later won the BET Award for Best Collaboration and was nominated in several other categories. In 2008, the single won a Grammy Award for Best Rap Song. 2007-2009, Three Rings. In 2007, T-Pain began work on his third album with Rocco Valdez, Akon, and Lil Wayne. The album was also his first under his Nappy Boy Entertainment. T-Pain's third studio album, Three Rings, was released on November 11, 2008. The album sold 168,000 records in its first week, reaching number 4 on the Billboard 200. A mixtape, PR 33 Rings, was released in early 2008 before the album. The album was preceded by three singles. Its lead single, Can't Believe It, featuring Lil Wayne, was released in July 2008. The single reached number 7 on the Hot 100 and number 2 on the Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart. The album's second single, Chopped and Screwed, featuring Ludacris, was released in September 2008. The single reached number 27 on the Hot 100 and number 3 on the Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart. The third and final single, from the album, Freeze, featuring Chris Brown, was released in October 2008 and reached number 38 on the Hot 100, and number 39 on the Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart. Guest appearances on Three Rings included T.I. Lil Wayne, Ludacris, DJ Khaled, Kira, Chris Brown and Kanye West among others. PR 33 Rings was the introduction mixtape for the album. In 2008, T-Pain continued to appear on numerous rap singles, such as She Got It by Two Pistols, Go Girl by Kira, The Boss by Rick Ross, Cash Flow by Ace Hood, Shorty Get Loose by Lil Mama, One More Drink by Ludacris, and Go Hard by DJ Khaled with Kanye West. T-Pain and Ludacris collaborated to perform Shot and Screwed and One More Drink on American late-night television programs Jimmy Kimmel Live on ABC in November 2008 and on NBC's Saturday Night Live in the same month. T-Pain appeared again on SNL in February 2009 in the SNL Digital Short. T-Pain also supported the album in 2009 with his Three Rings tour, which included sold-out shows across North America. T-Pain and rapper Lil Wayne formed the duo T-Wayne in 2008. The duo released a self-titled mixtape in late 2008. It charted on the Billboard 200 in January 2009. Their debut album was going to be released in 2009, but never was. In 2009, T-Pain hosted the BET Awards After Party and paid tribute to Michael Jackson in West Covina. 2009-2012, Revolver he collaborated with country pop singer Taylor Swift for the CMT Music Awards, and performed Thug Story, a parody of Swift's hit single, Love Story. In an interview with MTV, T-Pain announced that he would release his fourth studio album in November 2009 and that its title was Uber. He stated that although he originally wanted to release the album in the summer of 2010, his label had pushed the release forward. Regardless of these announcements, the album wasn't released in 2009. An iPhone application called I Am T-Pain features an auto-tuner, allowing fans to record and modify their own voice to accompany an instrumental collection of T-Pain's music. It was released in September 2009. In July 2009, T-Pain endorsed the 2009 T-Pain Killer Campaign a grassroots effort to help him become elected as president of Florida State University. In November 2009, T-Pain released the first single from his fourth studio album, Take Your Shirt Off. The single only managed to reach number 80 on the Hot 100, 
and was later dubbed a promotional single. Later, in February 2010, he released the official lead single from his fourth studio album, Reverse Cowgirl, featuring Young Jeezy. He later released an updated version of the song excluding Young Jeezy's verse and adding a new bridge. The single reached number 75 on the Hot 100 and number 64 on the Hot R&B slash Hip Hop Songs chart, becoming a mild hit. The single has since been dubbed a promotional single. T-Pain was later featured on the We Are The World 25 for Haiti single in February 2010, which reached number 2 on the Hot 100. In the fall of 2009, T-Pain began work with Cartoon Network's Adult Swim to produce and star in a television animated musical special based on Freaknik. Freaknik, the musical aired on March 7, 2010. In June 2010, T-Pain confirmed that his fourth studio album Revolver has been completed and mastered, but that it will not be released until album sales increase. He elaborated upon this in August 2010, stating that the album probably wouldn't be released until 2011. T-Pain's first feature film, Lottery Ticket, was released on August 20, 2010. In October 2010, T-Pain released his third promotional single, Rap Song. The song charted poorly, peaking at 89 on the Hot 100. T-Pain released a Nappy Boy mixtape called T-Pain Presents, Nappy Boy All-Stars Volume 1 which contained Nappy Boy remixes to Every Girl, All The Way Turned Up, and Forever. On May 5, 2011 he announced a mixtape for his album Revolver called Revolver. The mixtape released three songs, the first being, Hoes and Ladies, which featured Lil Wayne and Field Mob Smoke. The other two songs released were contest songs. The contest songs were meant for anyone willing to get on the track, and whoever lays down the best verse will feature on the track in the actual album. The first contest song was called, Motivated, which was a rap song and the second song was an R&B song for the singer, called, Merry Christmas. B. Martin of Albany, New York won the competition, and will be featured on the mixtape. T. Mixes, were made which are T-Pain's remixes to some 2010 hit songs. The released remixes were, No Hands, Black and Yellow, Loving You No More, Make It Rain, and, Like a G6. Two out of the five T-mixes were made into the official remixes. They were, Black and Yellow, by Wiz Khalifa and featured him with Snoop Dogg and Juicy J. The other T-mix that was made into an official remix was, Loving You No More, by Dirty Money, which originally featured Drake, but the remix features T-Pain and rapper Gucci Mane. T-Pain was featured on the hit single, All I Do Is Win, by DJ Khaled, along with the remix. He featured on Wisson and Yandel's single, Imaginate, and Bun B's single, Trillionaire. In the last two quarters of 2010, he was featured on hit singles like Pitbull's, Hey Baby, and Nelly's, Move That Body. He was also featured on another single by Wisson and Yandel along with rapper 50 Cent called, No De Hemos Que Parge. The last two singles T-Pain were featured on in 2010 were the official remixes to Black and Yellow by rapper Wiz Khalifa and Loving You No More. T-Pain was featured on the first single by DJ Khaled called, Welcome To My Hood, off his new album We The Best Forever. The song featured him along with Rick Ross, Plies, and Lil Wayne. He is also expected to be featured on albums such as Drake's Take Care, Lil Wayne's Thar Carter 4, Tech N9 Nez All 6s and 7s, and many more. A new toy called, I Am T-Pain Microphone, will make its way to stores everywhere in 2011, at the price of $39.99. On January 29, 2011, T-Pain was featured on Italian DJ Benny Bonassi's song, Electra Man released as the third single in the album of the same name. In January, Trandall released a single, Can't Sleep, featuring T-Pain. On March 22, 2011 the next single from Revolver will be released titled, Best Love Song, and features American singer Chris Brown. On his Twitter he stated that he would release his Revolver mixtape when he gets 500,000 followers and release his album Revolver. When he gets 1 million followers, also in 2011, he gave another cameo to an adult swim show. This time, he appeared on the sixth season premiere of Squidbillies, performing a version of the theme song in addition to the original song, Driving In My Truck, with Unknown Hinson. On October 7, 
RCA Music Group announced it was disbanding Jive Records along with Arista Records and J Records. With the shutdown, T-Pain will release his future material on the RCA Records brand. The album Revolver was eventually released in December 2011, alongside the transatlantic top 10 single Five O'Clock, which samples UK songstress Lily Allen and features Wiz Khalifa. Brought to you by Wikivideo Documentaries. Would you like to know more?